Fact or fiction, you can't cut down a linear glass scale. Hey guys, welcome back to Build Something Cool. My name is Dale and this is my shop. So today we're gonna to talk about cutting down a linear glass scale. The myth is that you can't cut one of these down because there's a piece of glass in there. And this is actually an optical encoder. This reader runs along it. Well, if that glass breaks, the scale is no good. So if you cut it, will the glass break? That's what we're gonna to determine today. So what do you use one of these scales for? Well, it's kind of like this here. It's very similar. It gives us a very accurate reading here with a digital readout. This you would mount onto a machine, like back here we have it on the milling machine, and the digital readout is that screen back there. That's called a DRO, or that's the abbreviation, which is an abbreviation, of course, for digital readout. And we're gonna try to cut one down today. You know, I've seen on YouTube other people use a bandsaw, cutoff wheels, hacksaws. Well, today we're gonna actually go for a chop saw. There's this little piece of glass in here. Check this out. See that? That's a little piece of glass. And it's very fragile And the way glass, how do we want to say? Glass breaks because of vibration. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a piece of foam, cut it out, insert it in there so that glass doesn't vibrate at all. So let's see what happens. We've got our foam stuck in there. So which way are we gonna cut it? Well, we have that piece of glass that's sticking straight up, so it's kind of just like hanging up there. So what's the best way to cut this? Do we put it vertically? Do we cut it on the face, the side, the back? Which way do you guys think I should do it? Leave down in the comments what you think. I'm gonna actually try to take this top face, push it against the back, and see what happens. Oh, you hang up and try again. Just joking, guys. I gotcha. You guys want to see what it looks like? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Check this out. I think we have some great success right there. All right, well, I think I have to go now try the bigger scale. Let me put a disclaimer in there. If you guys want to cut your scales down with a chop saw, go for it. But if it doesn't work, oh, sh please don't blame me. I'm just the messenger. I had a technique. I tried it and it worked. And if I've earned your subscription, please subscribe. And until next time, go out in your shop, build something cool. Thanks. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. Oh, shit.